Time to go inspect the statue. You Me. I knew you'd be back for the jewels. You killed my brother. Now you'll suffer the same fate. I guess thieves need to be quick on their toes. But you won't get away from me this time. Prepare to die! Wait! Jessica, it's me. Don't you recognize my voice? Uh, Alistair? Stay your spell, Jessica. I wasn't slain at their hands. Stay my spell. But it's too late. Alistair? Alistair? Is that really... It's me, Jess. You have to listen to me. As do you travelers. After I died, a part of my soul was allowed to linger in this statue. Even now as I speak to you, the power keeping me here begins to evaporate. Time is short. Look into the statue's eyes. The truth lies within. Hurry! The day I died, the door to the tower was already open. I thought it was strange. So I decided to look around and see for myself. That's when I saw him. The clown! You saw the clown! Introducing the clown. There he is. I am the clown. Such a pity. Pity? What are you talking about? Who are you? Answer me. Me. I am Dulmagus, and I was referring to the fragility of human life. Fragility? What do you mean? My... my sword! I... I can't draw my sword! I said such a pity. A terrible pity that a shining young star like you should chance to encounter me! What? Have you done to me? Clown teletransport. shall return the favor and remember yours as well now let us finish this before I feel any more pity do make us I 
don't understand it myself. But it seems the statue of Alexandra has been awaiting your arrival. If the memory of my tale can serve you on your quest, it would bring great relief to my soul. My stay here is coming to an end. It's time for us to part. Say goodbye, Jessica. Alistair! Don't leave me! One final thing, Jess. Mother may try to stand in your way. Nevertheless, follow your heart and do as you must. Farewell, my little sister. Magic affair. There can be no question. This is Dolmagus's treachery. Cool, blimey! <laughs> Funny guy, Yangus. It would appear that Alistair also wishes us to bring Dolmagus to justice. His sacrifice shall not be in vain. Now, we have yet another reason to stop Dolmagus's foul reign of terror. I shall await you by the carriage. Um, I really must apologize for my behavior. We'll talk more later, but I need to be alone right now. I'll see you back at the village. Sure. I'll do my grand escape now. Fucking head butters. Son of a I'll come for you soon, bull. Just not right now. As of right now, I'm no match for you. Son of a bitch. 
Nicely done. Skipper down. Probably save my progress just to be safe. That's what I'll be doing. How come you? Oh, okay. So you do. So you do are able to save. Priest, priest. Now talking seriously, I should check that memory card. Maybe buy a new one. Yeah, yes, I want to continue the adventure. I might need to buy a new one. This is f this one is failing. Feeling badly. Oh. Hello. Should probably sleep. Hey. Thank you, bangers. I slept well, fairly well, thank you. This should be good. Hold on there. This is a family matter. The lady will attend to you shortly. I'm going to ask you again, Jessica. Are you entirely bereft of compassion? you not mourn your own brother's death? Not this again! Of course I'm sad! I can't believe I even have to say it. But all you can think of is tradition and family obligations. I'm talking about avenging his murder! Avenging? You will stop this foolishness this instant! You are a young lady, not a warrior. You really think Alistair would have wanted this? You will mourn your brother's death like a proper lady. It's our family's way. Our family's way? Who cares about our family's way? I don't expect you to believe me, but Alistair spoke to me. He told me to follow my heart. That's why my mind is made up. I don't care about the consequences. 
I'm going to make Alistair's murderer pay. Very well. It's obvious there's no talking to you. Do as you wish. But as far as I'm concerned, I no longer have a daughter. I want you out of this house at once. Fine. I was planning on leaving until you came to your senses anyway. Bangers, mash. I'm sorry for not telling you the truth before. Forgive me. Uh, are you really leaving, Jessica? Yeah, I am. And I want you two to watch over the village while I'm gone. Alistair told me this would happen. He said you two would protect the town and grow up to be famous warriors. <laughs> hmm, kind heart. Come on, chin up. Your mission guarding my room is over. I want you to patrol outside from now on. Yes, sir! <laughs> well, I'm leaving. Thanks for being such a great mum. Have a nice life. time to investigate this area all right I want the armor there has yes yes here 